Welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how to make Mary Berry White Chocolate and Raspberry Cheesecake. For this recipe you'll need the following ingredients. For the base, 150 grams of digestive biscuits, 60 grams of butter, plus a bit extra for greasing, one tablespoon of demerara sugar. And for the topping you'll need 200 grams of white chocolate, a 250 gram tub of Philadelphia, 300 ml of pouring double cream, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and 250 grams of fresh raspberries. So we place our biscuits into a sealable freezer bag and we're using a rolling pin here or the base of a saucepan to crush your biscuits into tiny crumbs. The other thing which you're going to need for this recipe is a 20 centimeter tin and I have previously buttered the base of it and lined it with baking paper. So I'm heating the butter in a small saucepan over a low heat and we're going to let that melt and next we will be adding in our crushed biscuits and the sugar and we're going to stir that. And in goes your sugar now. Next I'm adding in my crushed biscuits. And I'm going to stir that until it's all combined. Place the biscuit mixture into the base of the prepared tin. Press with the back of a spoon until it's all level. Place in the fridge to chill while you prepare the topping. Now for my topping I'm adding in the cream to a mixing bowl. We're mixing in the Philadelphia to this as well. The vanilla extract is going in here as well. Now I'm melting the chocolate over a pan of boiling water. So the melted chocolate goes into that bowl as well and I'm going to stir all these ingredients together to combine to form your topping. So now we place the topping on top of the biscuit base. Now we smooth it out with our wooden spoon and that's ready to go into the fridge overnight. Now I'm covering it with cling film and I'm going to leave that in the fridge overnight. So we've left that overnight so I'm taking off my cling film now and there it is. It's all set and we're going to take it out of the cake tin as well. So I'll just loosen that up there now and slide that out. There we go. The final step then is to add on our raspberries on top. So I'm going to decorate the entire top surface with these raspberries. And there we have it. So if you would like to make this recipe, you can find this in the Mary Berry Everyday Cookbook. Tune in next week for another amazing recipe.